We'll guide you through how to transfer all data from an old iPhone to a new iPhone. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. This is super convenient and useful to be able to do, and it can save you so much time. So let's go and get started. So first of all, your new iPhone needs to be on the setup screen. So I've already set this iPhone up. So what I need to do is go and reset this to get back to the factory setup. So open up the settings app, scroll down to general, scroll down again and click on transfer or reset iPhone and click on erase all content and settings. And we can just go and follow this through and erase it all. I've now gone and factory reset it. As you can see, we're back to the hello screen. So go and swipe up like so. Now what you want to do is just come on to your old iPhone like this and unlock it. And you should go and get this pop-up about setting up a new iPhone. So you need to make sure your phone's unlocked. If it isn't already, go and click on unlock. And it's then going to go and connect to it. What we can do is go and scan it just like so. And as you can see, it's now gone and done that. It says getting things ready. It will go and say continue on your other iPhone. So go and choose who you're signing in. I'm using my main account here. And then what I need to do is go and enter the passcode of the other iPhone, which I'll go and do. It now says it may take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. So all you need to do is go and wait. And now you'll just go through the general steps of setting up your iPhone. So here you can go and set up Face ID. And now we can go and continue the transfer. So I'll click on continue here as I want to transfer the data. I'll need to read through and agree to this. It then says here's everything set up as you had it on your other iPhone, which is what we want. So I can press continue and just go through these general settings. They're going to be up to you really. There's an update it's making me do here. So I'll just go and do this now. After the update is finished, they'll go and reconnect. And as you can see, they've now started to transfer the data. So all you need to do is wait. And just like that, they've now finished. If you found this useful and you want to go and see more, then please consider subscribing and liking the video.